this stream is all about now we're going to try and make a cartridge so we're going to try and make this into a CRT file so we've got some things to do to make sure it's going to work so 21st April so configure to be a cartridge Ooh, can't spell. Cart ridge file. Well, I haven't got the stuff to make a cartridge, but what I thought was we'll make a CRT file and see if it works and then I can figure out how how to get it into a into a cartridge. I'm sure someone can do it. I'm sure someone can do it. So, the whole point of a cartridge is that it's memory that cannot be changed. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So, I we need to make sure that we haven't done any self-modifying code, which I hope we haven't. I hope we've done it properly. Right, so the biggest one would be draw. That would be the one with the m modifying code in there. And it looks like we could have remmed it all out. No, it, when, you've, when, you've, when you, you can't have self-modifying code in a cartridge, because remember, it's ROM. It's only read-only. So you can't modify it. That's the whole point. You can't modify a cartridge. The only way you could modify, have self-modifying code is to, is to copy the cartridge into RAM, but then figure out how to turn the cartridge off. And you can't, because in reality, it's a hardware, it's a hardware line. So when you put the cartridge in, there's a, one of the lines is to say, I'm a cartridge. And you can't turn, I don't think you can turn that off. So let's see. Are we self modifying? Doesn't look like it. I think we turned it all off. This is what the self-modifying code was. We was changing the... In this self-modifying code, we was changing the instructions. Prepare calc. Uh, let's see where that, where that is. Nope, took it out. Have we got the old? Or did I remove it altogether? Ah, old draw. Here we go. Right, this was the self-modifying code. So this was actually changing the instructions. It wasn't actually changing the values. It was changing the instructions. So, and that's why we redid the draw. Because... What happened was it tested which was bigger than which. That means that would have determined whether it was adding or subtracting. And so I set the, in the original, here we go. I set, so if it's subtract, I set it to set carry and subtract. And if it was add, it was Clear CLC and add. So the self modifying code was actually modifying the code, not the location. Yeah. So, but that was the old one. So the new one's not doing it, which is good. I'm pleased about that. So you've just got to make sure there's nothing else. But there's only one way of doing it, and that's to try it. Now, the thing that I was worried about was here. Because in the graphic, or I should, yeah, in the graphic command, we are, we are setting an area of RAM that's going to be contained within the cartridge. But, 
that is only going to contain um, the the color, the graphical color, which is white, I think. Com graphic color. Uh, 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 uh. I forgot where everything is. Let's try in there. Yeah, there. So we're setting it there. So, graphic, 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 graphic. Oh, too many things open. So we must be setting it somewhere. Xbox Live changing? No. No. Now, that, I think, is... I think it's one... I think that's what we're setting it to. Where's the cartridge initializer? Cartridge initializer. I wonder if we're setting it down here somewhere. Yeah, one. So what we need to do is we need to rem this out Uh, are we jumping to that? No. Right, so rem that out. So $1.84 to $1.88, that's what we need to do. And the way I thought we could do it is in here. So we make, we make sure that we're at 8400 and then we do I think it's a fill I'm not too sure let's find out directives I think it's a fill uh, maybe it's not Maybe it's not. Um, we're not doing save block. DBC. Ah, could be. Yeah, I'm, it's there. It's definitely there. So, um, it's going to be DCB for byte. Right. DB. And we want to do that. One. Let's see if that, see if that um, builds... We'll send it to memory just to see. <laughs> Obviously something went wrong. Oh, it doesn't like hex values. Oh, I'm missing a column, comma. Yeah. So, there we go again, project, build, program to memory. Oh, 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 aha, right, let's see if it's filled it in. Oh, that's not good. We've gone over.
Well, it definitely did it. But we've gone over. So we're going to have to this is going to have to move to that <laughs> two three Still gone over. Hmm. That it's so it's the error handling routine that's gone over. So we'll put that back there because they're just locations, it's that that's gone over. Right, so we should be alright now. Yep, yeah, we've stopped at 3B2. Then we've got all the constants. There's the fill there at 400, which has gone to 8800, which is where our error handler starts. Right, so that then goes all the way down to nine six three three. So that should be made that should be made can be made into a car. But one thing I did know one thing I did notice was to make a car work properly you've got to send it to the right to the very end, which is this. And then So that would be E. So that should now fill the entire 16k with data there we go 9fff ooh ooh that's one short there we go That's better. Go straight. So the next byte is basic. So that's great. Right. Let's try this out before we try and make a cart out of it. So program and run. <laughs> Time <laughs> for optimization. Hmm. Hey, face. Right. So we have to reset. Now, we have not got any code to clear the screen, yeah? We have filled it in with one. So when we go into gra so when we do 10 graphic, we should have a white background. And it hasn't. Ooh, didn't. So did it actually fill it in? Did it actually fill it in?
Oh, I thought I asked you to debug. Oh. <laughs> yeah, work got me to update my Windows 10 the other day. <sighs> Absolute pain in the backside. Right, let's get this to the right place. Eight. Go on, load up. Right, so it's loaded up. So eight four hundred should have ones in. And it does. Eight four hundred. There we go. Right. Control reset. this that's not clearing out that's not clearing out the display that's not clearing out the display something's gone wrong with the graphic command hang on Oh, ah. oh! <laughs> how how we forget so quickly? How we forget so quickly? Ah, I've added a new command, haven't I? I've had a new command. I forgot. There we go. That is what we're expecting. So, because I've already set the screen area to one, which is white in high res mode, it's the color white. When we burn that to a cart, that should always be one. So we don't need to overwrite it. You know, it's part of the cartridge. So it'll always be. So, we are... I told you this was going to be a short stream. <laughs> We're ready to try and make a cart. Now, I know I've already done a video about this. And I've got to remind myself how we how how we do it. So let's see if we can find it. Let's see if we can find that video. So we know what we're doing. And it was Kaidos, I think. This one. Let's have a listen. Oh, shut up, John. Right. Change. So this is the. So we need. To, so. Yeah, we've done. We we already did that. The. We already did that. We already did that. Aha. We're here. Override Kaidos. And then what we do is you have to uh, fire up a command prompt and set your path to vice, which I've done here. So I've set the path. All to right. Vice. Okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hold your horses, jump. So my. That 
that's the one we're running. So path equals Oh, you can't paste it like you can do in there. Uh... Oh. Mark. Hello. I'm trying to set the path and it's not working. Copy. No paste. Oh, I'll just type it in. Do we have to do that? Okay, so if I go back to um, oh, I don't know where I'm going to there. Right, X sixty four. Does that run? No. Let's do this properly. Do it this way, John. Path equals that. Right, X64. That's better. That is better. Right, so we are in. We're in our right. We're in the right place. Right, what do we do next, John? What do we do next? And then what you do, you run the. There's a programming vice called Cart Convert. There you go. Cart convert, okay. So cart conv minus t normal minus name um, minus i program name program name that's osk basic isn't it um yeah osk basic so osk basic dot prg and it's osk basic dot crt <laughs> yeah well let's let's just copy that oh I don't know if that copied but I'll do it again copy that I'll put it in notepad aha Right, just in case it goes wrong. So this should make me a cart. Oh, it's successful. Ooh. Right, okay. Right, so let's find the emulator up. And now attach a cart image. Do 
Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Get up. Yeah. There we go. One cartridge. Come on. Get in there. Get in there. Right. Let's see if we've got any of the files knocking about. Right, so we've got the... Right, new. So we've got the files knocking about. So let's try load circle 2. Now this may not work because I think we changed our commands, didn't we? Uh, we changed the commands, didn't we? Let's have a look. Graphic. Right, so first of all, we need to put clip colon clear graphic. So that's draw circles, right? Right, let's see if this runs. So we've got some commands in there. So we've got we've got a circle, we've got draw commands, and some more draw commands. Right. Oh, and it blew a fuse. Right, we'll have to see what the issue is. Right, let's do that again. Because it should be okay. Print FRE. Yeah, it's it's right. So it's set. Hmm. Interesting. Let's run sixty four debugger and see what's going on. Yeah, well, we're not doing that, so detach everything. Was it? Right, detach everything. There we go. Right. Uh, F9. Insert cartridge. And we are looking at in there. In there. Okay. Right. So we need to find out what's going on. So we need to see if it's wiping out RAM underneath ROM. Right, here we go. Ooh, I better is our is it set? Yeah, it's set. Ooh. 
Oh. Okay. Hmm. Right, F9. Now we, okay. Let's just do one thing at a time. I think I know what the problem is. I think. Oh. <laughs> what did I do there? What on earth did I do there? Here we go. Am I still streaming yet? Um, I'm looking... Ah, that's what I'm looking for. So we're... So we're in normal mode. Right. So run does that set it properly oh it's set it to be zero 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 oh Right, that's set the high res screen to B000, which is somewhere around here, I think. That's where the cartridge is. So that eight, eight and a half, nine, nine and a half, eight, eight and a half, there. Here, that's where it's set it to. Here, this is it. So it's set to that screen. Hmm. So if I... L right, let's detach everything. And then open the actual file itself. Do the same thing again. Why are we going to B now? So that's cleared it out. Hmm. Where should be there? Bitmaps at eight four hundred, which is right. Screen should be there. Right, 30, draw, 10, comma 10, 150, comma 150, diagonal line, here we go. Oh, what have I done? Oh.
So that's okay. Hmm. So that's underneath. Right. Okay, I'll let it off. It's doing it. Right, detach everything. F9. Oh, it's control and zero. We'll do it that way. Control and zero. Load the cart in. Do the same thing again. Ten. Graphic. Twenty. Clear the graphics. Thirty. Hmm. It's f it's flipping, but then goes and errors. So that means we are still setting some. I'll right, we'll leave that like that. We are we must be still modifying code. Got to be in the draw command. Gotta be. See, that's the problem now because with the cartridge, it's ROM, we can't change anything, so it's gonna error if we are modifying code somewhere. But I don't don't see it. I wonder if it's place and dot. Let's have a look. Well, it's not that. Everything should be pointing from here, so that's not... We haven't got anything referring to itself. So that equals that, that equals that. Hmm. We need to find out why. Right, so this is the problem, yeah? So, let me just load it up. So I think, yeah, that's loaded the, the ROM cartridge in, because it's there, look. That's the ROM cartridge there. So, and it's also auto fire. So I'm going to detach it. So we haven't got the ROM in there, so I'm going to load the PRG file in. Get it to pretend. Tap the program in. Right, so when we run, we get a line. So that's what we're expecting. 
Right, see if I can save this. Right, okay. So if I detach everything again, this time we're going to attach the cart. Load. Oops. Test. Oh. Where did it save it? Oh, I'll just type it in, John. Oh. Yeah, we are definitely upsetting it. So, um, we need to put some breakpoints in. That's the start. Right, where, 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 where? Um, yeah, that's the long one. Where's our dump? Here, here it is. Right, so clear, 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 clear. Where's that? be right at the very bottom here we go nine six one one let's check that out let's just make sure it's clearing out the um, it's clearing out the uh, the graphic space so 10 graphic 20 CLG right here we go so um, we want to be where do we want to be there Now the problem is, is it clearing it out? We can't see you. Let's turn the ROM off. Let's see what we're doing, dealing with. It's all zeros. So we're definitely clearing, we're definitely storing something, but it's not going, the VIC chip's not seeing it. That's all it's seeing. So there must be something going. Hey Arthur, 
there must be something going on between loading so I'll detach everything we'll load the program in again so that's where our programs loaded there yeah so So when I run this down here should get wiped clean. Ooh, Sinter I spelt it wrong, yeah. Oh, that's because I haven't reset it. It's not a cartridge, you only gotta reset it. See, it's wiped out our area there. Yep, so this has come out okay. So if we detach everything. And now load the cart in. Right, as you can see, our program doesn't load into memory. Right, it's missing because it's now a cartridge. Right, let's run it. Let's see if it wipes out the bit that we're looking at. And it does. But for some reason, the Vic chip in cartridge mode is not seen is not seeing the RAM. Hmm. Well, that's interesting. Where's the, here we go. So we're in Ira's biz bitmap. Here our bitmaps are 8,000 RAM and 0400. Oh, I wonder, I wonder. I wonder. Hello. Right, where is the graphics command? I wonder if we still need this in. Because this would, um, this would, um, store it on the RAM rather than the ROM. I wonder if it's something to do with that because we're setting the VIC to bank 2. Let's see, let's see if we can uh, figure this out. And here's me thinking it was going to be a quick one. Right, so that saved that. Uh, let's get rid of the cartridge. Generate it again. Right, detach everything. 
Um, oops. Grab that. Right, let's try again. Hey! There we go. Right, let's see if the draw line works. No. Now, why would that not be working? Hmm. Right, where's the um where's the plot point? Here we go. <clears throat> right, dot <coughs> eight one nine eight one D two. Two. Right, we're going to see if the um, if the it can actually see it. Right, so it's set. So, right, we need memory one, memory location one. Where are we? is 37 which is right so I have 10 switch off basic now and then this goes like this ooh what have we switched off I don't think it's going to tell us. Oh yeah, basic's gone. Yeah, basic's gone, which is right. But it looks like it looks like the cart the cartridge gone. The cartridge is gone. Right. Where's the my memory map? Uh, da -da 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 -da. Right, possible configurations including 8K ROM cartridge to be switched in at for basic enhancement program and 8K ROM at 
replaces basic or when cartridge ROM is selected to replace the kernel we're not doing that Hmm. Right. Um configurations. Where is it? Got to be there somewhere. No. I wonder if it's at the back. No. Da, 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 da. Ah, 64 memories configuration. Here we go. Memory with cartridge and basic. A power up, da da da, 8k, blah blah, yes. Right, so we are, that's default. So then we become this. Oh dear, all the configuration's different. So if we turn off basic, which is this one, no it ain't, this one, we turn off basic, so that's the pins that we're looking for, but we're in a cartridge, so it's there, so this says it's identical to XPROM being high, figure 5-1. So that's the oh, so it turns off the cartridge. All oh, right, so it turns off the cartridge. So if we turn basic off, <laughs> it turns off the cartridge. Oh, that's annoying. Um, that is truly annoying. But 
Right. So the whole point of this is to reconfigure it as as a cartridge um, app. So we need to change the way it works. So in the um, it's this isn't it here. Right. So. Um, So when we turn, so it looks like when you've got a cartridge plugged in, if you turn basic off, it turns the cartridge off, which is really annoying. That's what's happened here, isn't it? Yeah, it's turned the cartridge off. Uh, 37 right so let's put it back in so we should have um, we should have I'm not sure to be honest is the cartridge yeah the cartridge is back now look the cartridge is back it's it's a good point how does Simon basic do it I th I'm just wondering if Simon's basic puts users not sure Because we can't put the we can't put the high res screen at C thousand because that's the start of the next the next cartridge unless they unless unless Simon's Basic actually uses the higher the memory space but the problem is the color RAM's in there. Um, and I haven't got a Simon's basic cartridge to mess around with. So that is a bit annoying, that is. So with cartridge, so you turn basic off it's like figure five one and figure five one doesn't have the cartridge there I mean the, the whole point of me putting the graphical area underneath basic was we don't lose any we don't we don't lose too much RAM plates pl space to work with. Let me see if I can find Simon's Basics cartridge. Let, hang on, because I've got loads and loads of cartridges. Let's have a quick look. Retro stuff. C sixty four carts. Well, it's definitely not under S. Uh, let's try this. There we go. There we go. Right, we'll put that in the same place as there. So we can switch between the two. Right. Let's see how Simon does it. Oh, I've forgotten how Simon's how does Simon's basic work? Um, no. Nope. 
Right, here we go. Crash course in Simon's Basic. Right, programming aids. No, we're not doing that. Input validation. No, we're not doing that. Graphics. High res. 64. Oh dear. Let's download a PDF. <laughs> I'm not messing around with that. You don't think Simon Basic? Okay, F1. No, F1 didn't do anything. It'd be interesting to see if they do switch it. Um, there we go. See what it looks like. Oh, I think they do. The markers are not there. I th I, I'm just wondering, it, hang on, how big's the cart? 17k, how big's mine? Nine, yeah, that has gone straight into, um, that's not basic out altogether. So that's overridden basic, because there is nothing there. Right, let's see um, what we're looking for. High res, wasn't it? High res, 6-4. Oh, it's taking its time, isn't it? Oh, I was there already. Right, okay, so let's see. Graphic commands. Color, no. High res. To initialize the high resolution graphics mode by selecting a plotting area. So high res zero one. Okay. Ten. High res zero one. Twenty. Go to. 20. Right, okay, let's see which one was I in. Was it? Yeah, it's taking the whole thing, so let's see what it's doing. Oh, it's using the back end look. It's used in the back end. So where's the screen? Screen is at E8. Okay, let's 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 copy. Screen E8. Oh oh. Bitmaps at C thousand. So we could do the same. We could do the same thing, but instead of. Let's just check if we. If we knock out the kernel. So that's that one there. Do we still knock out? Yeah. How is he looking at the graphics? Oh, have I shut it down? Oh, I've shut it down like a wally.
I don't think he copies basic. I don't think he's copied basic. I think he's actually rewrote it. Because the reason why I say that is that here at A thousand that should have the CBM characters in. And it's not. So I'm just wondering if he's actually over he's made his own version of basic. Yeah. Because if I... Let, okay, let me just detach everything, yeah? If I detach everything, so it's just gone back into normal mode. Right, so a thousands up here somewhere. Right. You should see that there's a CBM sign up there somewhere. Hang on, let's get the memory map up. Right, that there is the that's the tags. It says that says CBM, a um, AO. Yeah. Hey, Microman. So, this is the original basic, yeah? So, if I attach Simon's basic, you'll see that that memory will change. Watch. You see it flicker? Right, so, let's do the same thing again. So, 10, high, res, 0, 1, 20, Go to ten. What is he doing? Oh, I know. I went to go to ten in there. <laughs> there we go. So he's He's wiped it out. Okay, so what's draw then? What's draw? Okay, what's PC? What's PC? Initialize the high resolution screen, selecting a plotting color. Ah, and background color. Okay, okay. Right. Oh, there we go. Rectangle. Let's do that. So, uh, 2011, uh, rec, rec 0040021. So, we'll go 10, 10, 150, 151. Right, here we go again. He banks out kernel. He banks out the kernel. He banks out the kernel and then where's his plotting routine? Yeah, he's bank he banks out the kernel, but Well let's just see what happens if I if I change zero. So to bank out the kernel it's Hi mem, hi mem. Whew. 
What's the hymen bite? Bite. Right. Okay. Char is bit two, one, and zero. So bit two. Okay. So that would make it. So minus two on that would be thirty-five, wouldn't it? Thirty-five. Oh, it's still there. Right, okay. Let's try that. Let's try that. So instead of banking out um instead of banking out basic we'll bank out the kernel and reconfigure the graphic to point to that area of space. So so to bank out the kernel Can you? No. Control M. No. Oh, that definitely earns you some points, mate. That definitely earns you some points. Right, that has, that has got to be written down somewhere. Well, I never. I ought to read the manual, aren't I? Right, okay. So, what we're going to do is we're going to relocate. So, the screen, the screen is at E800. But his bitmap is at C thousand. So what we need to do is we need to check right, I'm gonna minimize that. <laughs> right, so let's copy this and paste it in there. So kernel is banking out that. And so we'll remove that. Now, the problem is, we've got other places that we're, we're doing that. Um, where are we doing it? Where are we doing it? Right, where's clear G? Right, so we need, we need a, a, we need a constant. We need a couple of constants, constants. Um, I thought I had a constant file, but I can't see it. <laughs> hmm. Is it in there? No. 
Okay. Did I have it in here? Aha. Right. So we need... Right, bitmap start, bitmap end. So, uh, da, 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 da. where is it? Graph, not graphical. Get rid of that, I don't need that. Don't need that. Don't need that. That's the one. In fact, that's not the one, but we need to, um, here we go. Bitmap start. That's one place, but we also need it in here as well. Bitmap start. Bitmap end. Now we've got other places where we are doing banking out basic, and it's not there. I bet it's Phil. Yeah, here. So, um, Maybe I should create a function. Um, where should I put it? It's in here, isn't it? Right. Right, so bank out ROM does that. Bank in ROM does that. That'll sort that out. Right, fill. in ROM alright so that's that where else do we do it where else do we do it um Reverse. Yes. Um, where else? 
fill anything that we inter interact with the background. So let's have a look. Box, no. Character, no, I don't. Oh, yes. Yes, there. But that's that's getting that's getting the character. Yeah, that's getting the character. So that's okay. Right, okay. Um, erase. No. Nope. Uh, fill, we've done. Dump, load, save. Save. Yes, yeah, save is going to be an issue. There. Oh, that's going to be <laughs> that, that is going to be a problem for for saving because <laughs> you bank out the kernel, you can't save the screen no more. Hmm. <laughs> yeah. Um. We'll come back to that. We'll come back to that. But we can definitely. Yeah, we'll come back to that. Yeah. If you bank out the kernel. You can't do a save. Uh, plot off no mob color joy H. Right. So we need in graphic. Here we go. We need to work out what we're doing here. So we're no longer doing bank two. So if I go to my page, so we want bank three. The problem is phase. If where would we we copy it to? Because if we copy it. If we copy it under basic and then we have to bank out basic, we end up banking out our um, cartridge. So where else in memory could we copy 16K of memory? Because if we copy it lower down, we're going to be encroaching on the, the basic side. Yeah? It'd be interesting to see if... Um, if um, Simon did it, but let's see if we can do this. So we are, so we want bank three. We want bank three. So that's doing that. And then we want to change the video memory. Change the video memory to D018 I'm sure is that bitmap mode is there bit 3 So we want to put it there. That's the characters. So we want to put it there. So at the moment we've got it. We've got it. Where's the... Oh, here. We've got it there. 
So one, two, four, eight, there. So we want to put it E3, which is there. Oops. One, two, four. One, two, four, eight. Sixteen, thirty-two, sixty-four, one, two, eight. Right, that's the old way. So, was that right? The old way. Was there. No, it can't be. Oh, we're or in it with eight, aren't we? Okay. So whatever it was before, which had been this one, we're all in it. So we're turning bitmap mode on, but now we can't. So we're going to. That's what it was before. In fact, turn off what it was before and then we'll turn it on so the screen needs to go there. So that's 110. 1110. So that will turn the screen to E8. So. So E eight E nine E A E B Right, let's see if that works in normal mode. So are uh, we change our constant from there to A, A, B, C, C, D, E. And screen RAM is not there is um, E8. That was before. Right. Let's see what happens. F5.
Oh dear. That didn't clear out the right bit, did it? Screen, oh, the screen's in the wrong place for a kickoff. Oh, it's thrown a fat one, this one. Right, where's it putting it? Right, that's in the wrong place. And that's in the wrong place. Okay. So we sort that out. So it's not that one we want, it's that one. Oh one one oh. But the screen was in the wrong place, wasn't it? But that is the screen. So we need the um, high res bit part. Yeah, that's where the high res is going to be. So that's that. So so we're setting it to bank 3. And then we need to change the video address, which I've just changed. Maybe that'll solve it. Let's try it. Ooh, will do. Ah, dear. No, that's what the, um, Simon's basic was doing, wasn't it? Let's see if it's doing it right now. Let's get. Let's just make sure we've got the things in the right place. Oh, it's at D eight. And the screen's still at FO. The bitmap should be at C. Yeah, that's F8, 1010, still at 
step at a time. One step at a time. One oh one oh. Let's get the screen in the right place first. And then we'll figure out what we need to do for the. Um, for the high res and I thought this was going to be easy Right, so we've got the screen in the right place. No, that... Oh, screen's in the wrong place. The bitmap's in the wrong place. That is just... Wrong. Right, let's try again. Right, bitmaps in the right place, screens in the wrong place. So we need to change the screen. No, 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 it's not. I don't want that. I want. Oops. That. Um. Screen. So we're messing around with this. Screen base address, character address. So the screen base address we've set. Right. So where do we set the screen? So that's set in bitmap mode. Thought that would be. So that's where we set bitmap mode. Screen base address. Ugh. But that's it. It's set. Forward phase, go back to the thing. Right, D818, Vic memory chip. Video address, here we go. Right, 
Oh, I've got my slides, haven't I? Where's my slides? Here we go. Right, so we've got to set all those three. So if we want our memory up here, our screen up here, So C, D, E, that's the character memory. Let's get in the right place. C, D, E, so it's there, 1010, one, which we set. <laughs> Why is the screen going to the wrong place? Ah. Oh. Let's work this out. Yeah, that's what I'm about to do. Zero, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. A five. No, it's in the wrong. In the wrong place. Eight. D O one. There. A five. A zero A zero. Oh, well, they won't let me put right zero zero. So, what's that set me set me to? Bitmap and screen are zero, right. So one one screen is at C thousand.
There we go. There we go. It's in the right place now. And that's in the right place. OB. OB. That's what we want. B, 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 that's uh, A, B, 11, isn't it? So, 8 and 2. That's 11. Right, let's try it now. Oops. Right, so the bitmap set right. And the screen is off. The screen is off. So I've got my number wrong. Let's just check what I put in there. Oh. Why is that F? Oh, I know. That's why. Not wipe, not wiping out what was there before. Right, we'll stay where we are. So, reset. Right, we've got it in the right place. So we've got OB and C1000, right. So 20 clear graphics. Ooh. That threw a big spanner, didn't it? Oh, and I've just shut that down when I didn't need didn't want to. Clear graphics. That should be right. Oh, hang on. Is it that way? No. No, can't be. That's the lower. That's right, that's right, okay, so they're all right. So why, and that should be right. That should go straight through and store it in. 
So why did it go a bit funny? Um. Maybe I should have just left well alone. <laughs> and just forgot about cartridges. Um, let's find where I need to put a break point. Nine six one five. Nine six one five. Right, let's load it back in. Right, run. Right, so the screen's in the right place and the bitmap's in the right place. So this should be Y pin. So we'll put a break point there and we'll do F11 and see if it comes out. I think that went horribly wrong. Yes, and it would have gone horribly wrong. Ugh. Go on, tell me what I've done wrong. Have a guess. No? No takers? No. Right, the screen is 16K. So we're starting the bitmap at C1000. 16K is to E1000. What's in the way? IO. So we've just put one in everything, including the IO, and that's why the screen and bitmap's gone back to back to right. So what we need to do is in here we need to bank out the IO, do the clear screen, and then bank it back in. But the problem is now, oh. Oh, that's just made it a whole lot worse, that has. <sighs> Let's, um, where's Simon's basic? I want to check something. So the bitmap is at C thousand, 
and the green screen is at e8 so he's he's banking out he's got to be banking out the io every time right our io needs to change our banking io needs to change where did i put it because we're banking out uh, right we're banking out kernel and we shouldn't be we should be banking out the io so we need to do Right, okay, ow, character ROM. So that's what's left. So if it's one, so if the low RAM is on one, oh, can't do that, because we get rid of basic if we do that. Still have the same problem though, phase. D thousands the IO. How do we bank out the IO? Cause here, to bank out the IO, we've got to bank out basic, and we've already shown that banking out basic gets rid of our cartridge. How is how has he done this? he done it oh do I want to oh hang on So what's he doing here? Store zero in DO one A. Oh, that's the mask. That's the RQ mask. Loads. If it's not equal to eight three two seven. Let's have a look at eight three two seven. Oh, he's just storing it away. I was trying to see where he sets. Did I enable adverts? Not that I know of. They stopped me to insert an advert. Really? That is just... That is just rubbish. Um... Never mind, mate. Never mind. I'm just trying to find how he's done it. How he'd done it. Here we go. Load 01 or it with 2. So that's putting kernel back in. So how does he... Uh, 
That's luck putting Colonel back in as well. Oh, that's where he, he that's where he rem that's where he uh, dumps the Colonel. Puts it back in. But he's messing around with the Colonel. He is definitely messing around with the Colonel. I'm just wondering if I've got this the wrong way round. Uh, 11, uh, 10, 10, 150, 150, 1. Right, let's see what he's doing. He's definitely... He's definitely modifying, yeah, he's definitely modifying the back end. Where is that? Right, that. Yeah, th this, his screen's down here. But this is underneath kernel. Right, so he's this is definitely underneath kernel. This is the screen. Right, so where's the bitmap? Where's that character set dialog box gone? Well, where did the character set dialog box go? I don't know. I think he's. Um, he's, de he's definitely switching Colonel off. I thought there was a screen where we could see the character set. Ah, character set here. So he is <laughs> Right. Run. Right, so that's definitely That's in a weird place, that is, isn't it? go so he's right his ROM his graphics is at E at E thousand but he's so he's got his bitmap there so the where's the screen then He can't have the screen at E8. 
There's no way on this planet he can have the screen at E8. So where's he got the screen? I wonder if that's at C1000. Hang on. Is that... If C1000... Yes. There we go. Right, we've got it the wrong way around. We've got it the wrong way around. We have it the wrong way around. Zero B. But we've got the same as that. Okay. So that's right. So our so our understanding is wrong. E to ooh, this is gonna be good. E F We'll have to put zero in there. Well that's not gonna work, is it? testing compare branch if not equal oh it will work it will work right so graphic graphic so our command is in the wrong place uh, da, 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 da. That screen is at C O. Right, let's see if this works. D do, 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 file. Right, let's load it in. Oh, detach everything. Load it in. Right. Let's see if we get a white screen. Oh. Oh, that's stopped there. Oh, that's all right. That's all right. It's just stopped where we wanted it. Right, F11. So it's cleared the screen. Oh, has this worked? Oh yeah. Right, okay. Okay. Right, 30. Draw 10 comma 10 to 150. Right, let's draw a line. Let's see what happens. Yeah, we know about you. And it's drawn a line. And he hasn't thrown a wobbly. Right. Here we go. Here we go. Right, let's try it. Let's try it. Let's let's make it into a cart. Uh, let's delete what's already there. Conversion complete. Okay, so detach everything. Oops. Yeah, so I've done the same thing. I'm switching the kernel in and out. 
So I've switched kernel out when I need to look at it. If I switch it back on when I don't need to. If I poke straight through it, it goes straight to the RAM, doesn't it? Right, let's let's load our cart. So we're there. Fingers crossed. Come on. Oh, that's our breakpoints. I'll take them out. Oh, it's gone to zero, look. Um... I wonder if I have to um, set the interrupt so it stops doing the interrupts. Let's try that. Right, uh, let's delete what we've got already. Oh, I've just deleted the wrong one. Hello, all up. We are struggling, mate. Trying to make a... Got it. Trying to make a cart. Oh, stop it. Right, cartridge made, detach everything, attach the cartridge. Right, come on. No! What? Hang on, have we switched out our cartridge? Yes, we've switched out the cartridge again. Why is the cartridge switched out? Ugh. See the cartridge has gone look. It's no longer there because it's been switched out. Let me put a break let me put a break point at uh, where it switches it out. Let me see if I can find it. Put a break point where I switch it out. Yeah, that's where that's that's here. So eight one D two.
eight one D two. That's where it's going to be. So if I if we put it back in. <laughs> right, um, reset. Oops. Right, so it's going to break when we're going to switch out. There we go. Now everything is still in place. Uh, let's do character set, because this is where we're messing around here. Right, so let's step through it and see what happens. So this is our cartridge here. This is, this is our cartridge, so we're going to see what's going to happen, yeah? So we go in, we set the interrupt, load one, bank out the kernel, store it, and it's banked out the whole thing. It's banked out the whole thing. What black magic is Mr. Simon doing? What black magic is he doing, hey? Right. What black magic is he doing? How is he banking out the kernel? Right. Let's let's see um what what's the monitor? F8. Aha. Right. Um, can we do hunt? Yes. Hunt. 8,000 to 8,000. And we are looking for... Looking for... We are looking for A501. So A501. Right. We need to look at those. In fact, where are we? Where? Are, there it is. Yeah, snipped it so we can look at it. Right. Let's see what he's up to, shall we? So. 8118 So he doesn't touch that there 87B3 Here we go So he loads it hands it with FD now I've that's what I've got hands it with FD 
and then stores it back into one. What is he right? So he's doing the he's doing the same as me. Right. Let's quit out of that. Run. Right, he's in there. Right. Let's get to where we were. So there. So where's the cartridge? Cartridge, cartridge. So that's the cut. That's his cartridge. Yeah. So F10 loads one. FD stores it. His his cartridge doesn't disappear. So why is mine? Um, what's it called? Cart conv. Uh, T. I reckon it's something to do with this T. Types. Yeah, that's what I'm looking at now. So... Types, uh, types. The following cartridge types are supported. Binary, normal, hmm, okay. PRG. Okay, guys, what do you think our type should be? Is there a way of finding out what type this dude's is? It's in the header. Alright, let's see what mine is. And we'll compare the two. Hmm. Is is there a cart viewer anywhere?
is a type 4. Uh, so what type would that be in this? Do, do, do. There's a four there. Ah, mine hasn't got a four in it. So how do we put a four in there? I've just, I've just, I've just, uh, right, let's load it back in. I've just changed it to a four, but it's not loaded, look. Okay, so that don't work. So let's sit, let's come, let's try different settings. So So what do we think? Let's try that. Right, let's delete mine. Where's that? So instead of normal, we're going to put in Simon. Go away. File size 8192 doesn't match Simon's basics requirements. Okay, what's Simon's basics requirements? But it's more than 8192. Um, I 
Okay, guys, what do you think, eh? Oh, you're looking at the CPS code. So, how... How would we... Oh, it's a pity you haven't got build to cart, mate. Cool. So that's what I'm using, normal. Generic 8, 12 or 16 bit cart. Um... I don't know what type we'd use. Ultimax. Okay. I've already done all normal, mate. And it works. So Ultimax. Well... It didn't like that, did it? <laughs> um, did I spell it wrong? Oh, ulti, ulti. Let's try that. It's ulti. Well, it did it. Let's see if we've got a four in it. Oh, it's type one. But we'll try it. We'll try it. Give every, anything a go. Right. Um, open cartridge. Mine. Well, that's not loading. No, no, that's not loading. Uh, come here. Um,
Right. Okay. Let's make it a Simon cartridge. So this would go to there. Let's see if we can get it into a Simon cartridge format. Simon. Right, go. Okay, it did it. Let's see if it loads. <laughs> uh, we crashed C64 debugger. <laughs> yeah, we we crashed it. We crashed it. Right, so that's not going to work. So um, let's put this back to um, two. Cause a funny smell knocking about here. <sighs> right. Examining the different graphics cards. Uh, okay. <laughs> um I don't know what's right so we're putting our rum cartridge there And we want to switch out that. Oh, the Ultimax goes in the E1000. That's what we're doing here. How, how do we set that game to be inactive and all that? Oh, Simon's basic does overwrite basic.
how, how can we... Right, so... A normal cart. So he's got game active. He's got game active. So how do we how do we tell the cart that the game has got to be active? But we're doing game active there. So normal 16, low, low. Oh, how do we set it? We're trying to, mate. We are trying to. Uh, this parameter is optional. It enables repair mode. Broken input file. This option will accept input files but does not match the cartridge size. Okay. Okay. This, when it is given, cart will not omit banks that are empty. Hang on, there's a command there. Uh, what is it? Cart convert minus F Simon's. What did I call it? Simon's apostrophe basic. So is mine there? Yeah, mine's there. Oh, hang on. I didn't do it, did I? mindset generic cartridge it says it's a game how can I turn that game thingy off mode is there a mode in here Ugh. 
Right, Aquafin, this is what this is the problem we're having. Right? So let me load my cartridge in. Now let's load it in. And here here is my cartridge. Yep. So as soon Right, so I'm going to run this, right? As soon as I run it, because we are banking out the kernel, right? Because we now got the graphics underneath the kernel. As soon as I bank out the kernel, so to get to the RAM underneath it, the cartridge banks out and then it crashes. Look, the cartridge is gone. And that's the problem. We're trying to... St I'm trying to stop that when we bank out the kernel the the cart the cart stays there now Simon's basic cartridge stays there so I'm trying to understand what's the difference between Simon's basic cartridge and mine um, and how we can get that to set up like that um, so I don't know what it is I mean I mean, what's a G mode two cart and a G mode three cart? I don't know. Yeah, I just don't know um, how to get the right I, I need the cartridge to stay there so I, I don't I don't want the game line or the X line switched on and I don't know how to turn them off um, I mean, what's this SB? Let's try that. We tried the Simon one, it didn't work. I mean that one doesn't it doesn't like it doesn't like the size so it can't be that Oh dear. I just don't want it to set the pins. I want it to be this. I want it to be that type of car. Yeah, we know about that.
That's the ultimate one. We need to make one of these. So how do we make one of those? Yeah, we need to make one of those. There must be a a way of doing it. Oh, what am I doing? No. So which one of these do you think it could be? Because my cart now, if I do that, it's still got the game set on. So this is what we're doing, we're bank switching this away. Right, so we're this one here. So we're, we're this because we're setting game line one to be on. All right. Let's go back, go back, go back. So game is on. And then we, we drop that. But it makes that's the problem. It make it gets rid of everything. It just gets rid of everything. Like it's, it's, we want, um, we want this to be the cartridge, and the kernel to be out. So we want this to be RAM, but we st yeah, it's it's not there. Look, can't do it. Can't do it. How does the Simon Basic do it? Because that's it's doing it. We've we've seen it. We've disassembled it. We've looked. We see it doing it, and the cartridge doesn't disappear. I think it's that. I think it's down to that type.
Um, right. Okay. So Simon's basic cartridge is 16k. We need the basic ROM. Where's the basic ROM? Where's the basic ROM? There it is. Come here, you. Don't try this at home, folks. Okay, so let's 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 do something stupid. Right, let's see what this gives us I've done it again <laughs> right let's see what that gives us so we should have a program that's 17k right okay here we go let's uh, let's get rid of um, where is it there it is right let's do the Simon one again there we go so let's give it a go come on right yeah, I've just added basic because when I did it before, we made it 16K, but in but we just left it all blank. So what I've done is I've incorporated the basic ROM into our um, into ours. So let's see, are we a type four now? Are we a type four? Yes, we are. Right. Here we go. Let's see. Right. Detach everything. Right, open cartridge. Uh, mine, thank you very much. Right, we're on a winner. <laughs> we didn't get this far before. <laughs> okay. Uh, <laughs> Right, let's get the memory port into our cartridge and see what happens. Right, so our cartridge is here. This is our cartridge there, that's our cartridge. So here we go. What's the difference between that one and that one? Mm. 
No idea. Where does it say 8,000 in the cart room? I mean, we're using the yeah, it's we're using the same things. <sighs> yeah, because we have to bank out kernel to see the ram underneath, so we can ore it. But the problem is that it's when you as soon as you bank out kernel and you've got a cartridge there, it throws a fit. Because watch, if I detach it and then just just open the PRG file that created the CRT, yeah, and if I do exactly the same here, so this is the PRG in memory. Right, so it's exactly the same thing. I've just loaded the PRG that create, that was used to create the CRT. We run it and it works. Same code. It's the fact that we've converted it into a cart. So when we bank out kernel, it's banking out the whole thing. Yes. That's what it's doing. And it's driving me nuts. Yep. Yep. Just show you. There you go. There's the there's our there's our cartridge. But it's in RAM, yeah. But it's in RAM. So switching kernel off when you've converted it into a cart switches all the banking out. The only thing that's left behind I think is the No, it switches the whole lot off, doesn't it? According to that chart you gave us. So if we have a cart there we can't we cannot switch No, we can't switch the kernel off into RAM without switching this cart off. Yeah, yeah. Let's do that. Let's do that. So we'll get rid of this. And we will do that. So we'll do that on the cart initialize. So we'll create another function called copy cart. And we will cheat. We will nick this.
So we will do this. That's it. And we'll put that on the reset. So we'll do it after the stat point is set. Right. Here we go again. No, it's one thing we didn't do. But it's worth looking into. Right, that's our program set. So we'll do it back to a normal. There we go, normal. Okay, let's load it in. Detach everything. Get that. Right, that's copied. Did you see that? That copied itself. Right, okay. So we are in our cart area. So 10. Uh, CLG. Right, here we go. <laughs> Mate. There you go, mate. You definitely deserve that. Oh, dear. Right. Okay. So we have now, we have now a cartridge working. Oops, wrong, wrong screen. Right, 40. Circle. Uh, 100, 100,80,50,0,361. Right, let's see if it draws the circle. You can do this, this, that'll give you the list. There you go. test is right so I'm going to detach everything I'm going to detach everything I'm going to open the PRG hopefully this should still work even though it's got a copy of itself there you go so it's just copied itself oh can't spell
Does it still work as a PRG? Yes. So it still works as a PRG. No, I don't think so because... Um, oh, you mean for basic? Yeah, we still have to do that. Right, so let me... Let's run it in... Um, let's run it in Vice properly. So let's attach our CRT file. And we'll load one of our demo and see what happens. I forgot the that. There we go. So that's the draw command working. That's the circle. Right. Uh, what else have we got? What else? Um, what else have we got? Uh, shape. We got a file called shape. Right. Run. Right, let's put the CLG in there. So remember, this is the cart. Yep. Yeah. And what else we got? Um... Fill. Let's try that. Fill two. And of course, we've changed the commands, haven't we? Oops. So Aquafin, we've now moved. Um, so the high resolution space was at A thousand to C thousand, right? But now we've moved it into the kernel area. So the high resolution place, <laughs> the high resolution place is now in um, E E thousand to F, uh, E thousand to zero. So it's the last 16k, and that's why we're now banking out kernel instead of banking out basic, because um, we had a problem. Um, we had a problem. What was the problem? Oh, we had the problem of banking out, uh, banking out basic. 
was banking us out. So we could put all that back now. We could put all that back. Let's do that. So, um, yeah, and we lost the cartridge, but now we're not doing that. So we could put it all back to how it what, how it used to be. So I've got, so I've got it here. So if we get, put that back to A, and that back to C, and the screen RAM is back to 0400, but the CLG, that's okay. This one is gonna be different, so we're gonna RAM that out and that, put that back. Uh, RAM that out, put that back. So this is now 84, 85. <laughs> what are you? <laughs> oh dear. Right, that's putting that back. Um, 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 graphic routine. Right, so we're not banking out kernel anymore, we're banking out basic. Right, that should be it. To file. Let's delete the cart. Let's create it again. So we're okay. And let's bring it in. Attach CRT, this one. Right. <laughs> right. Let's see if we've not broken it. Right, we're still on. We're still on. We're still on. I still want to make sure we're still on. Are we still, are we now in the right place? Hang on, let me just fire the debugger up. Right, so let's detach everything. Attach the cart. Right, um, we want to be in that one. Right, so now we should be clearing out this area here. So here we go. Be good, be good. Oh, oh and the crowd goes wild. Ah. That means now um, that the save's going to work. That means now the save's going to work because we don't need to bank out kernel. We can now save and load the graphics in. Yes. The line appears as many small lines. That's only because of the way the mem memory's worked out. Um, oh, I'm so pleased. I'm so pleased. Uh, have we got any more? Got any more test files? Um, only John test, but I'm not too sure what that was. 
Test three. Let's load test three. Right, okay. Ooh, 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 ooh. Yeah, that still works. Right, let me get rid of that basic bin. Don't need that. And there we go. Right, there you go, guys. We are fine. Oh, what? Go away. We have finally <laughs> put basic in the bin. <laughs> we have finally converted our graphics extension into a. Let me uh, fire it back up again. Here we go. Into a cartridge. So it now it will behave as a cartridge. Um, it's a no. It's bigger than that. It's a, it's um, eight. It goes to eight to a. So that's four eight. Yeah, it's an eight. It's an eight K cartridge. Yeah. So. After all this time of um, coding this, yeah, yeah, we've managed to create ourselves a graphic extension that allows us to draw circles, lines, and all the other stuff, and we've made it into a cartridge that will behave as a cartridge, so, you know, when we reset this, it's a cartridge, and, uh, was it tab and page up? Is that reset? Or is it escape? Oh, I don't know. Tab. Page up. There we go. That's it. So. <laughs> it's. Oh, man. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you for the 300 bits, mate. I hope you've enjoyed this type of coding you know not game coding it is productive coding you know mate because the next thing i want us to try to do is to create a word processor in uh, the c64 where i'm i'm getting ready to do hunchback so that'll be the game coding so once we've done the disassembling of myriad we'll get on to doing start hunchback and start getting you guys to get involved in developing hunchback but you know game anyone can write a game um but writing applications is a different skill set so i hope i want to do a word processor i also want to write an assembler for the 64. <laughs> watching me scratch my head <laughs> <laughs> oh dear so we 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 I'm trying to make the streams uh, um varying subjects so we've got the disassembling of myriad going on this I think this is now done unless we come back to the fill part and uh, try to make it a little bit more intelligent which you never know we might do Uh, a Twitch bot in ARM assembly. Wow. I'm having problems with Node.js, but there we go. Yeah, exactly. Uh, you know, we, we can build a, a simple word processor very quickly. 
but then getting it to do all the clever stuff, right, cent like alignments and stuff like that, that can that can uh, get tricky. Right, my other half has gone to bed, and I've been, according to OBS, on this for four hours. <laughs> Using Linux on the Pi, so that should make it slightly... Well, my bot's there on that. So you could turn the lights off if you want. But that's where my bot is. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> so, but mine's my bot's running in Node.js, not assembly. But that's... <laughs> Cheers, mate. <laughs> <laughs> so I hope you've enjoyed this. Um I have. I like doing this. I like I like I like the challenge. <laughs> Aquafan on. <laughs> Alright, well thank you very much guys for joining me and I will see you in the next stream, yeah? I'd like to thank all the Patreons that are contributing to my channel. Without you guys, I wouldn't be able to do what I'm doing right now. Thank you very much.